Hey everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel. In this video, we will see how a snake can kill a lion. Snakes can kill lions if the snake can, uh, bite them, and they can inject the poison into the lion. The snake is speedy and can strike very quickly, but the lions also have a pretty good reflex, so they're quite cautious when they're near the snakes and can leave the area immediately if they sense an assault coming. So, while it's challenging to strike a lion, snakes can still manage to do so, and if the lion is fearless, it can kill it by biting the snake. This situation happens frequently, but snakes are afraid of lions, so they typically attempt to avoid it. The lion does not have any antidotes, and they can undoubtedly die from the snake's venom. Although lions can kill snakes, they typically live in feelings of pride. However, if the snake must pass through the lion pride or must grow close to them, then a problem may arise. At that time, the curious lions, especially the young ones, may approach the snake and may collide with it. They may also try to sniff the snake, understand it, or even play with it. The snakes typically do not consume large amounts of food regularly. Instead, they consume a small amount, digest it, and then resume their searching activities. They often wait for four to five weeks and resume searching activities again. For this reason, the snakes will only pursue prey with a significantly higher probability of success rather than attempting to go for a lion, which is undoubtedly not going to be helpful because it'll be risky and they could also fail. There are several types of snakes, including king cobras and anacondas. The green anaconda, a member of the boa family, is by far the biggest snake in the world in terms of weight. Although its reticulated python cousin can grow to somewhat longer lengths, the anaconda's massive girth makes it nearly twice as heavy. Green anacondas can reach over 29 feet, weigh around 550 pounds, and diameters over 12 inches. Males and females are vastly different in size. The yellow, dark-spotted, and Bolivian anaconda species are additional species from South America and are all smaller than the green anaconda. A giant snake like an anaconda or king cobra can escape the collision with a lion, kill a young cub lion, and devour it. The lion won't die instantly and can almost certainly kill the snake because of the lion's strike on the snake's head and hair. Mostly, the snakes make a plan for where to hide and how to attack it because they cannot simply go inside the pride and attack the lion cub because that would be too dangerous for the snake no matter how big they are. Instead, they will wait outside in a location where the lion cub can start to walk. The snake, even anacondas and big pythons, can struggle to kill a big padded lion since they are so enraged. However, big snakes that lack snake venom can kill the young snake and can undoubtedly consume it. They are highly hazardous, capable of killing snakes, and have excellent reflexes. They are strong with excellent reflexes and large claws. They have been outfitted with all the small weapons they can employ against a snake in a fight, which can instantly kill it because they have a massive bite board. The likelihood is that the lion will go straight for the snake's head or throat if the snake is caught off guard, and you know that it has a propensity to bite the back of the head. No matter how giant and powerful the snake may be, it won't be able to respond if the lion manages to bite the snake head. Even if the massive and giant snakes usually stay away from the lion's pride, since they know that if they do, they will be swiftly killed. They avoid them, dwell where they won't be bothered, and hunt various herbivores and little animals that won't hurt them. And fighting with animals also uses a lot of energy, and the snake needs to conserve energy. Because snakes don't feed frequently, they consume food, digest it, and then begin hunting again after some time. And if the snake cannot capture prey with his sharp teeth or use his lot of energy, it's failure for the snake. Therefore, even giant snakes avoid lions in normal circumstances. But because they all reside in the same area and lions are also curious animals, collisions between them might occur. As you can see in the video, the mother lion is killed during the crash and dies a horrible death. The lion will fail if the snail possesses venom and can inject it into the lion. 